Good morning, kiddos. It's so good to see you again online. Um, we are very excited uh, for this week and all the activities that we have planned. And um, we, one thing that we really love is working together. So this morning, the 5-6 team, the teachers have come together to say good morning and just to encourage you over the next week um, with our remote learning schedule. We know that you'll be awesome and that you can do it. Um, and let's just keep connected to one another this week as we work through and maybe we'll have a little bit of fun. Morning, five sixes. Um, so every day will look basically the exact same. So you'll all have a devotion every morning, then you'll have three activities to complete. One will be English, one will be maths, and one will be a different activity, maybe mapping or um, something else. But you'll you'll see on the <laughs> on my ad online. Mm. And then there's some optional activities as well to do if you choose to, but they don't. You don't have to. Mm. And just a reminder of some of our expectations as teachers, uh, we've got the three activities and our expectation, expectation is that it's a minimum of 30 minutes per lesson. Uh, you're all big boys and girls, so if some of the activities go for a little bit longer than half an hour, I know that you'll keep persevering through it. Maybe if it gets to the one hour mark, then feel free to just finish there and upload what you've, what you've completed. But 30 minutes minimum. Um, so just a reminder to either take a very clear photo of your finished task and put that up onto the My Ad Online section, or you can click on the text response and type in your answers or hit video and record yourself talking about it, however you want, but we need that proof of you finishing that activity. Right, and tell yourself, remember, it's only Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And um, when we are ready, we'll be back on Friday. So the suggestion is every morning, wake up early as usual and get yourself ready for learning because there'll be lots of activities planned for you. Don't forget about going to your backyard with your siblings or with your pets. Have a run around, have a short walk. Uh, yes, you are, you are allowed to go for short walks. Eat healthily. All right, don't snack on all those um, chippies and so on. Have a short break between the lessons so that you do not feel fatigued and not spend a long period of time using computers or are not necessarily needed. And spend this time with your family. So being a devotion, the teachers are here as well. If you feel upset or uh, disheartened with the things around you, Remember that you can always send us an email and uh, we can reply an email to you as well. So before we end, let's close our eyes and we pray to our Heavenly Father things that are bothering you. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I want to thank you for your <laughs> for us, our family members and helping us to keep safe. We pray that whenever we do not understand what's happening, our lives that we close our eyes take a deep breath and say god i know it's your plan just help me through it you can also tell god that you are not feeling okay and that you are drained and you're tired and that god will calm our minds heal our hearts and take our worries away so remember mr Goldfine, miss for miss george you and myself we are there for you okay we're all going through this together we pray all this in jesus name amen amen all right, miss you guys. Have a good week.